All right, we're here today in Las Vegas in a neighborhood called Charleston Heights over off of Jones and Alta in the southwest part of Las Vegas. And we're gonna check out a bank-owned property here that has substantial uh, damage to it. It's just kind of crazy what people are doing to the, some of these properties. This room here was originally the garage and they converted it into a bedroom and it smells absolutely terrible in here. The neighbors informed me that it was a, a Mexican family that lived here and they didn't pay for three years. They just fought the, the foreclosure the entire time. So they finally got pissed off, I guess, and decided they were gonna take all the electrical out of the house. So they broke holes in all the walls. That's coming from the outlet. And then this is where it was stapled into all the different two by fours. So as it makes its way across there, they just broke holes to tear it all out. And up through the ceiling. And I don't know what their plan with this floor was. It has like a stamped and stained type of look. I don't know if that's what they're going for, but there's paint splattered all over it. So broken windows. This is the amazing part right here though. This house is only listed for $14,900. And it's gonna sell, my guess is under 20, pretty much for sure. Probably 16, 17,000. So it's 1,100 square foot, I believe. So you're getting it for $13 a square foot. It needs a lot of drywall repair, which is all cheap. But they did take everything. Most of the plumbing is out of the house. Um, all the electrical. Um, there's still some stuff under here. I was just taking a look. So the ceiling's all ripped out. So I guess most of the plumbing is still here. It's just, here's the kitchen, what's left of it. So you need all new kitchen cabinets, which you can get on Craigslist pretty cheap because everyone rips them out of the house and then sells them on Craigslist. Uh... So it looks a lot worse than it actually is, just because of all the drywall damage, which is so cheap to, to fix all this stuff. And with all the holes in the walls, it kind of makes it look pretty, pretty bad also. But it just shows how desperate people are getting to go through all the hassle of ripping out the copper wiring out of the house. I'm not sure why uh, why they ripped this out of here. This carpet is just nasty. It's like hard from so much. Uh... And there's some way, I forget how I got out there to get to the garage. Was it the garage that I went in? Well, I don't know. I don't remember how to get out there, but this is a house. You can have this house for about 15 grand, for sure under 20 grand. And uh, it's 1,100 square foot. If you're a handyman or whatever, you can do some work in here and make it pretty nice. So I don't think it's too bad of a, of a deal. So, let's see you later. Bye.